up, YouTube? Alex here, AKN25. Bring you guys a top 32 deck profile from YCS San Jose with, uh, what's your name, man? Irvin. Irvin. All right, what's the next All right, what'd you talk with uh, YCS San Jose? Uh, Magic Spectre. Magic Spectre. All right, do you want to say anything over oh, here, bro? You, you like Kusha Mubaru, right? Yeah. Uh, shout out to my sponsor, Capeta, from Veracruz. Thanks, man. And uh, shout out to everybody in San Antonio that helped me build the deck. Uh, yeah, shout outs to everybody that let me cards and uh, especially Cone and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, what'd you finish in Swiss by the way? You remember? 28th. 28th? That was scary. <laughs> Alright, so for the monsters, I played three Draco Slayer. This is like your best card in Pendulums. Uh, three Raccoon, Stratos. Search for any monster. Uh, three cat. I opted to play three, even though it's kind of slow, but you need the consistency there, and you almost don't play a lot of uh, skill twos. That one's a skarm. Uh, three fox, the best one in the deck. Searches for the traps, and it's also a skill two. Uh, three crow. Uh, searches for spells. And I opted to play one eccentric archfiend because I didn't want to go in into an event uh, with floodgates being possible, like mistake and anti spell fragrance. Uh, for the spells, I played three upstart because I love consistency, two chicken game, and two pegasus, and three terraforming. So a lot of people were telling me to play three of the pegasus, but I didn't like drawing like multiples. So I opted to instead of playing three Pegasus, three terraforming, and then another terraforming target would be chicken game in, in case I did draw one of these. So it's just like a tutor. And uh, for the Magic Spectre spells, I only played two Cyclone and one Storm. Uh, I thought Storm was good for this event because I thought that I was gonna play a lot against a lot of Burning Abyss and Shadows, but I really didn't. So I only played against one Shadow and one BA. Uh, two MST. Same reason for the Eccentric Art Fiend, I didn't want to go into an event with Floodgates. I mean, with Floodgates being uh, possible. One Wavering Eyes, because I really, I was scared of the Mirror Match, but I didn't expect as many. So I, I opted to play one. And that's it for the main deck, Spells. And then for the Traps, I played, uh, for the Magic Spectre Traps, I only played two Tornado and two Tempest. Uh, I was opting to play three of this, but I noticed that the hands that I was breaking with were the hands that I was like opening too many spells or traps that were magic specter spells or traps, and uh, I couldn't resolve them. Well, I could resolve them, but it wasn't like consistently. I, I couldn't consistently keep on scaling and like pendulum summoning for like four or two, so it was it was like a minus one every time. So I only like to search these out. I don't like to draw them. And then one Song Morning, one Emptiness, and two Stormy Mirror Force. I thought, How was Stormy? Uh, I honestly thought it was going to be better than it was. It, it definitely put in work, but I didn't really see it when I needed it. Yeah. That's it for the main deck. Then for the extra deck, I played two against her. This is an out to the big ships. So good. I don't see why they. Uh, Tudori, Zero Soul and Roach, because I was scared of Infernoids. Even though I have, I feel like I have a good matchup. Uh, one Magister, this guy, is pretty good. Got me out of breaking. Uh, Castell, Exiton. I definitely did. I just wanted to put this in because I felt unsecure going into the event without an Exiton, but this card I never summoned and I. I, like I never needed it. I would have played a cowboy maybe instead. Uh, Dweller, and that's it for the rank fours. And then for the rank threes, I played Acid Golem. Oh, I forgot this for the rank fours. The Diamond Camp. Uh, yeah, it's an out to the uh, big ship, like the biggest ship. And then also destroy. I mean towers. <laughs> towers. Yeah. Acid Golem out to the towers. I mean Dark Destroyer. <laughs> Alucard, two totem bird because you can literally make this like every turn if you're playing if you have the right hand and two chimera tech because I side cyber dragon. Then for the side deck, I played for the monsters. I played two Valor, two cyber dragon, and two flying sea. 
Oh, also shout out to Miguel for letting me letting borrow letting me borrow these. I felt like EA was still gonna be a, a thing, so I I felt like I needed to cite this Cosmo, and then like this is against Denko. Even though I don't play so many traps, but one turn can do a lot. Uh, one MST, the third MST. Two mistake and arrest. This was a last minute thing. Uh, in testing, I wasn't citing these, but then in theory, like this is really good against Necros and the, and the mirror match, so I just wanted to play that one. Two wavering eyes for the mirror, Glee. Two wire taps. This was MVP too, and two iron wall, Cosmo, Infernoids. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. Cool. Uh, do you want to say anything else, or? Um, no, I just wish I could have done better, gone farther. It happens, man. There's always next time, right? Yeah. All right. Congrats on your talk. All right. Thanks.